The Therefore connector for SAP NetWeaver makes it possible to send data between the SAP and Therefore systems. The connector is based on ArchiveLink and is certified by SAP AG. By using the Therefore system in conjunction with SAP, it's possible to maximize the use of both systems, increase the visibility and accessibility of key business data, and ensure the long-term performance of your SAP system. In this demo, we'll be covering the main functions of the Therefore connector for SAP NetWeaver. In this first demonstration, we will see how an incoming invoice is saved to Therefore and processed in an approval workflow. The data is then sent to SAP. Next, we will provide a brief overview of the standard archive link functions supported by the connector, such as early and late archiving. Our final demonstration shows how the connector supports outgoing documents, including storing large data and print lists. In this first demonstration, a scanned invoice and its metadata are saved to Therefore. The invoice goes through an approval workflow, and the data is then sent to SAP. The incoming invoice is scanned in using an advanced scanning solution with OCR. The extracted information, including the company code, the amount, the currency, the vendor number and the dates, appears as index data in Therefore. All the invoice's line items are listed in a table field, including the quantity and amount. Of course, much more information can be extracted and sent if required. The document is then checked in and saved to Therefore. This triggers a workflow which automatically assigns another user the task of verifying the data. Of course, additional workflow information and tasks can be added depending on what is required. Once the workflow has been completed, it proceeds to automatically send the document and index data to SAP. A bookkeeper must now post the invoice in SAP. Once found in SAP, the saved document can be viewed in the Therefore viewer by clicking on the attachment list. If all the data is correct, the invoice is ready for posting. To check if the invoice was successfully posted, he can access the booking receipt and view the post. Once again, the invoice can be opened in the Therefore viewer from the attachment list. Since the data is automatically captured upon scanning, data doesn't need to be entered twice. It is immediately available. We will now briefly cover the standard archive link functions supported by the Therefore connector for SAP. Early, late, and parallel archiving scenarios are all supported. With early archiving, invoices are first scanned into Therefore, then booked in SAP, and finally matched automatically. The Therefore matching service then extracts the metadata from SAP and sends it to the linked Therefore document. The documents are scanned into Therefore using the Therefore Capture Client. The Capture Client automatically splits the invoices and reads out the barcode value before saving the documents in Therefore. The Therefore barcode service runs in the background and sends the barcode value to SAP at a pre-configured, customizable interval. Next, the bookkeeper receives the paper invoice and posts it in SAP. The barcode value is entered either manually or with a barcode pen, 
and SAP immediately checks if a matching therefore document already exists. Once matched, the documents are linked and can be viewed directly from SAP in the attached documents list or directly in the therefore viewer. The index data for the therefore document is fetched from the SAP object by the therefore matching service. Parallel and late archiving scenarios are also supported. For example, an invoice is first booked into SAP and a barcode is printed. This barcode is placed on the invoice before being scanned into Therefore. The Therefore barcode service sends the barcode to SAP, where it is then matched to the SAP object. In this final demonstration, we will see how all documents created by SAP can be automatically saved in Therefore. Let's now open an outgoing invoice. If the invoice is printed out, a copy is saved directly into Therefore. In the Therefore Navigator, we can find the invoice that was just printed in SAP. It is also possible to access the stored Therefore document from SAP via the attachment list. The connector can also save print lists from SAP. Rather than storing a copy of the list in SAP, the print list can be stored in Therefore instead to save space and increase the performance of the SAP system. It's also possible to reduce the load on the SAP database. SAP can export older database information as binary files, which can be saved in Therefore. If the files are needed again, they are requested and extracted back into the SAP database. We've now seen how the Therefore connector for SAP NetWeaver can handle various incoming and outgoing document scenarios. The features of this connector help improve the performance of the SAP system, as well as increase document security, traceability, and ease of access.